You okay, can, so you can look at it. Look at it like this. Um, you you have a sink that is clogged and the water's running. The water's running in your clogged sink and the sink's filling up. It's filling up. It's filling up. It's overflowing. It's on the floor. There's water all over your kitchen because this water is overflowing. So you start cleaning up the water. You're mopping up the water as fast as you can. You just keep mopping the water and mopping and mopping. When are you going to stop mopping? At what point do you stop mopping? Well, mopping up the water is like running. You can run all you want and, and keep mopping up that water, right? Mm -hmm. Or what about the clog in the sink? Why is the sink clogged? Well, that's like um, your insulin resistance. Insulin resistance is the clog in the sink. Um, and, uh, and then what's the simplest way to deal with this overflowing sink? Shut off the water. That's all you got to do, shut off the water. So in the Diabetes Solution Kit, we wrote a book, a program on, first of all, phase one is shutting off the water. And then what happens? Well, then um, you can bail out the sink. And that's what you do with what medications help you bail out the sink. Exercise helps you mop up the floor, clean up all the excess water. And so you keep exercising. Uh, you may be on your medications for a while. Um, and then eventually you get to the bottom and you unclog the sink. And that's where you start becoming insulin sensitive again. And now you turn on the water you can eat. And guess what? It all goes where it's supposed to go, back into your cells and your blood sugar stays normal. You don't have an overflowing sink because first of all, you shut off the water. That's the first thing to do. And so that's what the Diabetes Solution Kit does. It shuts off the water.